How are you doing today? It is October 14, 2020, and this is how insane and ridiculous this world has become. Look at this article. It says, The Flaming Lips played an in-person concert where everybody was in bubbles. It says, For years now, as a regular part of the Flaming Lips concert, Wayne Coyne has gotten into a giant plastic bubble and sang from within it, which he's doing right here, okay? It says, now, during the pandemic, that concept is about as fitting as it has ever been. The fact isn't lost on the band, as they have given a performance where everybody was in bubbles, both the band and the audience. Coin shared a clip from the performance yesterday, and it's certainly a unique sight. Check this out. <laughs> Can you believe that? That's what we're living in. That's what we've come to. <sighs> it says the performance apparently had two purposes. To test the idea of doing a full-on bubble concert and as a video shoot, according to Brooklyn Vegan. Uh, Settlist.fm notes the band only performed two songs and played each twice. <sighs> I just I just don't even understand that it's gotten to this, okay? People seriously are doing this, you know? Look at the part that we are trying to get down is what it, what does the crowd do about going to the bathroom and getting drinks? <laughs> oh, wow. This seriously is... I, I don't even know what to say. I'm going to leave this video here. I'm, I'm honestly speechless. You know, when you're seeing people like that, this is what people are doing. They're bowing down like this. I mean, are you kidding me? When are people going to stand up? What do you think is next? Do you not think that this is going to escalate? It's not going to stop until we back it up and stop it. They're just going to keep escalating. When nobody's revolting, they're just going to keep doing this. And what's bad is, it's too late. We can't even revolt now or stand up to them because look at everything going on with the protest. It's perfect for them, right? Now they can bring in all their new technology, like their new laser-mounted, you know, tech on those Hummers that I showed you yesterday. Oh, yeah. They, they, what are you going to do now? Now you go ahead and try to revolt. They have the technology to, just to kill you, to get rid of you, whatever they want to do. They're so far ahead now because we have not stood up. So all I ask is that we share this information. We may not be able to, you know fight against them as a whole, but you definitely can still fight for your family and for your local areas, and you can for sure make a difference by saving a few more people from getting the, you know, the vax that we know is the end goal. So, everybody stay safe, stay strong, continue to pray, pray against what we're seeing here, because this is, um, it's horrible. It really is. We'll talk to you all real soon. God bless.